everyone. So uh, the chords for Three Little Birds are just C, F, and G. So we're gonna go through those for you on the ukulele. So you're gonna take your left hand and you're finding your ring finger on your left hand. That's the one, two, three, fourth finger. And you're gonna put it on the bottom string. So there's one, two, three, four strings and you're gonna put it on the bottom. And then you're gonna go down from one, two, to the third fret. So the bottom string, third fret, and that string should sound like this when you play it. So then we're gonna strum all four strings, and then we're gonna strum it together. And that's the C chord. Now the next chord you're gonna do is the F chord. So that's where you take a peace sign, and you take your index finger, and your index finger goes on the one, two, third fret, or the, sorry, the third string, and then the first fret. So that's where that one goes. And then your middle finger then goes on the first string, second fret. Okay, then it would sound like this. And then together like this. And that's the F chord. And then the third chord you need for this song is the G chord. So you're gonna put your fingers essentially where these stickers are, but on the instrument you have at home, you probably don't have stickers. So let me go through it slowly. You take your index finger and you put it on the second string, second fret. You take your middle finger and you put it on the fourth string, second fret. And you take your ring finger and you put it on the third string on the third fret, like that. Okay, and that's, it should sound like this. And I check every string just to make sure that all of my strings are working. If, it, if I have it wrong, if I'm holding it in the wrong place, right, it buzzes and then I know it's my fingers in the wrong spot. So I shift my finger back and now I know I'm playing the right chord. That's the G chord. Hey, Mr. Ropke, please play a C chord. And an F chord. and a G7 chord. Thank you. All right, students, so today we are learning the chords for Three Little Birds. Uh, there are only three chords in the song, C, F, and G7. And on the piano, we're gonna use G7 instead of G because it's easier to reach that chord. So we're gonna start with C and we're in C position. So I'm with my right hand, okay? And the C chord is C, E, G. Then, in order to play the F chord, I'm gonna do it in a different position than usual. So instead of jumping all the way up to F, I'm just going to move these two fingers here. So I'm doing C, F, and A. C, F, A, and you're gonna notice that's the same as if I did. It's almost the same. So instead of jumping, we just move two fingers instead of every finger. So we're gonna go C, E, G for the C chord. Then we're gonna go C, F, A for the F chord. And then we're gonna go to G7. So we're gonna go B, F, and G. So the only places your hand needs to go in this song is the C chord, the F chord, the C chord again, maybe, and the G7 chord. And this is a really good pattern to practice because it might come up a lot when you're playing songs with three chords. This is a good exercise. So now we're going to check out the left hand for Three Little Birds, and it's essentially the same thing, but in mirror image. So you have your C chord, C, E, G. The F chord is C, F, A, just because remember, instead of doing the C up here, we're doing the C down here. So C, F, A, and then back to the C chord, and now G7 is here. B, F, and G. So C chord, F chord, C chord, 
G7 chord. And this is once again, a really good exercise to practice if you play the piano because you're practicing chords that you're gonna use a lot. 